The double team is attracted at the baseline on Nafisa Collier, but the weak side gives up a bucket. That's something about the bigs for Atlanta is that many of them can also guard in the perimeter, including Parker and Elizabeth Williams. But right now, they got to figure out how to guard in the paint. Courtney Williams continues to shine in this season, in her second season with the Atlanta Dream. And Sylvia fouls once again. LaChina, is there anything else that we can say? Five deflected by the Dream. Dantas lets it fly from outside, doesn't go. Bounce down a little bit. Sylvia fouls, finally gets it to go for Minnesota. Bringing more minds and understanding to the LGBTQ plus community. Sylvia fouls with the deflection underneath. Can't touch the ball again. So Courtney Williams secures the ball Ooh. and a block by Sylvia Fowles. She'll be an all-star in this league one day, I truly believe, as she stays healthy and continues to, to get better. Crystal Dangerfield working her way. But she did get in front of her and get her shoulders squared. I'm just not sure she was completely in front of her when that contact was made. So you're seeing a couple adjustments. A matchup you'd love to see her going against Crystal Dangerfield, last year's Rookie of the Year. And Sylvia Fowles can't connect on the first one, but in those instances, it's almost you just have to let her take it. Sylvia. Touch. She's not just a banger. Sickness, non-COVID related, but Crystal Bradford so far bringing a lot of energy to the paint. But not enough on that rotation as Sylvia Fowles once again finds an easy look on the basket. Carlton all the way to the rim. Can't get that one to go, but guess what? Sylvia Fowles with the cleanup committee. 